Hello there and welcome to Fairyland Cottage and thanks very much for joining me here today. I'm going to share with you how I make broccoli sprouts. Now I eat broccoli sprouts because of the high content of sulforaphane, which is one of the most potent food derived antioxidants out there. So it's super nutritious and I'll leave links down below to scientific research showing the benefits and such. But for this, you're only going to need a little bit of equipment. You will need broccoli seeds that are suitable for sprouting. A good health store should be able to supply you with those. And if you don't have a little lid like that, you can just use a muslin cloth. So pop a tablespoon of broccoli seeds into a glass jar. And just cover them with some good quality water. And you're going to leave that overnight. So what I do is I'll do it the night before and leave it overnight to just soak. This helps all the seeds to germinate. And either cover it with this little stainless steel sieve or a little muslin cloth will do. And then put it into a dark spot. I just pop it into a cupboard and leave it overnight. The next morning, you'll see kind of the water will be a bit cloudy. So you want to get rid of that water and then rinse it once or twice. I just do it over my herbs. Two jobs at once. And then back into the cupboard it goes. After a day, you should see little sprouts starting to form. Again, rinse them off and shake out the water and what you're going to do for the next few days is rinse them out every morning and evening. And this is about day three and I want to show you, you see the way there's these little tentacles coming out of the sprouts? This means they're just searching for water. So it might be warmer than usual, especially if it's in the summer. And maybe you might need to rinse them three times a day. So don't be worrying. I thought when I started making broccoli sprouts that it was some fungus, but it's not. Just rinse them and then back into the cupboard they go. So you keep repeating for the next couple of days and then on day five they will look like this and I pop them out into the sun just to get a little bit of chlorophyll so they will go even greener and they kind of taste a little bit peppery and I just pop them on some bread and eat them that way. You can pop them on a salad, sprinkle them on top of your dinner. There's endless amount of ways that you can eat it and they're super delicious, super nutritious, really easy to make. It's very hard to get broccoli sprouts in the supermarket that aren't in plastic packaging. So it's really cool to just make your own. So that is it for this week. Thanks Emil for watching. I really hope you like this one. Ask me any questions down below and I'll help if I can. I'll have a wonderful week and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.